Girl, I must give it Heaven sent Yeah, you are a blessing I'm glad you're here I will pass your test I will never do you wrong Wrong, wrong, no, no, no It's a beauty manifest Like you're outside You are something special And I'm surprised you said I'm on your luck to go on this dog show y'all i'm gonna show you know shoot some shit show y'all what oh cleveland doing Mommy, look at all right i'm about to turn my camera <laughs> decided to take Gypsy to the dog show but then we changed our minds and tried to give Royce the benefit of the doubt and take him out in public too but no nah, we not taking him out like not nowhere crowded like this he did good but you know it was too much for him and we don't want to take those chances <laughs> I couldn't believe Royce tried to grab old girl hand when she walked past him. Thank God we was on our, you know, doing our due diligence and paying attention to our surroundings and, you know, paying attention to our dog as well. But Royce is too overprotective of us for us to ever put him in that type of situation again and um, cause him any problems as long as, I mean, as well as us any problems. That was too much excitement for him. Um... Too many people up close and personal, too many dogs up close and personal for him. Like when we at home or, you know, when we walking around at the park with him at the beach, 
you know he cool because it's not that many people he he calmed down after a little while you know people can walk up to us and talk to us but you know in that type of environment that was too much and i don't know what i'll do if i lose him for um some stupid shit happening so for that no nah, we won't put him in another situation like that this was our first time going to a, um a dog show um and it was a cool look you know what i'm saying a little cool little scene with no drama everybody was there showing love you know hanging out kicking it talking about their dogs no drama i think i said that already but it's hard to go somewhere in Cleveland where there ain't no fucking drama. So, I repeat that twice if I did. But anyways, um, it was cool. It's, you know what I'm saying? It was a little hood dog show, but you know what I'm saying? I'll do it again every year. Whenever it be here, whenever they decide to, to put the shit together, I'll pop in. It was so packed here that we really even didn't get to see none of the dog show. Um, just so happened my daughter got in where she fit in and got a few little snippets of one of the um, one of the shows. But other than that, it really was no. We we really didn't even get to see shit for real for real. Except for when we went outside in the parking lot and everybody was walking their dogs around out there. But, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, it was a cool little, a cool little get together. He 
look way different in person, boy. Voice ain't gonna never get better.
Damn, what happened? to come is somebody tried to reach down and pet somebody else's dog and the dog bit his finger off and it was banging on the ambulance because they found the person finger was trying to give it to the EMTs. Come on chicken Tina. How did that even happen? He probably got bit by a dog. How you know? Somebody's dog. He was trying to touch my dog and the dog bit him. Check in, Tino. Come on, check in, Tino. Yeah. Got my lovely bully crew passing out my business card. Tino ain't passed none out for one. That's what I'm getting. Boys can't get no work from now. Boys can't get no work. None of these dogs get no work from now. He only passed out one. Let me get one more, bro. No. Okay, lover bullies. So that's it for today's video. As always, I want to thank you for tuning in to our channel. If you haven't already, make sure you go ahead, like, subscribe, and tap on that bell so you can stay on top of this fire lover bully content. Be blessed.